Okay, sorry for the crudeness of this. Yeah. So, you want this here facing you. It's going to be easiest because that's the way it's going to work. And the reason a Marty is in black, eh, which is a marker, it's just to see them. There's that many holes, you can't see them. You know, so you've got to try and pull it away and mark it up. So, basically, if you get the first one, now, you'll see what I mean in a minute. Uh, I'll stick one of these longer screws in. Uh, just now. Now, if you can see that, really, you get one and it pivots to the one you want. Now, that's why I marked it in black. So, and you get the other one. Yeah, it's a bit fiddly. And to be honest, these screws aren't good enough. I tapped them out, but I'm not happy. So I just need to buy machine screws. Easy enough. But I've just not been there yet. So yep, yeah. So as you can clearly see, yeah, uh, these are all marked for various routers. All the numbers correspond to a router. So if you've got that router, that's where the holes mark up. Some only have three screws, some have four. Uh, these have two. That's what it states. So, when you flip it over, you're going to be working as such like that. So that's going to be perfect on your guide rail. That's the perfect angle. Now this, just sits on top. Now you'll see what I mean about the short screws that they supply. These short screws only just come through and no more. They don't actually go all the way through. So if you want to be able to hold that on, you need something to hold it on. And uh, as I said, the spark plug, the top of the spark plug is uh, ideal. That'll do the job if you haven't got anything else. Voila, done. So, uh, yeah, I hope that I hope that clarifies it a wee bit. Uh, it can obviously go the opposite way. This can go this way, uh, depending on where. No, it can't. Okay. No, yeah, it can. Sorry. Yep. It has to be precise. So that can go whatever way you want the extractor to go. So can I come from here, or from here, depending on where you put that on. Uh, so yeah, there we have it. It's pretty simple really, just took a bit of working out. I did see somewhere that somebody asked about, oh why did it, why, why have they taken that plate off, that plastic plate off, they should have holes through that. Well, if they did that, that would change the, the heights that this is set to. These dimensions are all set for this thickness setup, so that extra thickness there between there and that is the thickness of that. So that's a no-brainer. That's why. Uh, so yeah, sorry. Uh, that's just. But uh, yeah, and as you can see, the black holes marked uh, here and here. That's E corresponds. So as I say. You put your Bosch facing you, the Bosch sign facing you, and the corner away from you. So that corner there is uh, the opposite way to, it's at the top and the right. Uh, it's going to look different here. Uh, yeah. So. 
As I say, you can put it round the other way. It just means you're standing at the back end of the the uh, the, the guide rail. So yeah. Okay. Hope it clarifies. And uh, yeah, thanks.